Hi there, friends. In today's video, we are going to be connecting this Epson printer to this Windows 10 laptop. It's a very easy process. I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Now, for this video, we're gonna be using the Epson Workforce WF-3620 and connecting to an HP laptop running Windows 10. Now, this is gonna be a very, very similar process for any of the printer models that are still supported by Windows 10. And there is a huge database, which is really nice. Now, the one nice thing about this Epson printer is it actually has Wi-Fi capabilities. But to make things really simple, we're actually gonna be connecting via this USB cable. And I'm gonna show you again how easy these modern computers make it to connect to your printer. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna take this and we're gonna use uh, our one of our USB ports that are located on the right side of our machine. You may be located in a different place for you. And we're just gonna use one of those and stick it right directly in. Now, as soon as you do that, Windows 10 is gonna see that you wanna set up a specific device. Again, as long as your printer is in its database, it goes to work automatically for you setting up that printer. It's a really, really nice function. So what we can do is check on the progress of this. We're actually gonna come over here and we're gonna go into our settings. So I'm gonna click on the Windows icon and then I'm gonna click on the little gear icon over here and that's gonna bring up our settings. So once we're in there, we can actually go over here to our devices option. I'm gonna click on that and as you can see, the device is now ready. Set up and ready to go is basically what it says. So if we actually come over here to the printers and scanners bar, we're gonna click on that and you can see that the printers that are available now are that specific Epson printer. Again, this is gonna work really great in a very similar fashion for most modern printers. So once we're done with that, you can actually open up your document that you wanna print from and again, select that specific printer from your dropdown option. All right, friends, it is really as easy as that to add a printer, to specifically add this Epson printer to the Windows PC. Hope that's helped. If it has, would you guys hit that thumbs up button? It helps us make more great videos. Also hit that subscribe button because we got a lot more Windows 10 tutorial videos coming up soon. Thanks so much for watching.